Hello everyone. Today in this video we are going to talk about Robinson annulation reaction. What is annulation reaction? Annulation is a ring formation reaction. Our Robinson annulation involves Michael addition and aldol condensation. I suggest you to watch my videos on Michael addition and aldol condensation to understand this reaction better and the links for the reactions are given in the description box. The Robinson annulation begins with Michael addition reaction followed by an aldol condensation. As you know, the Michael addition is a reaction between a Michael donor, which is a nucleophile, maybe an enolate or a carbanion, and a Michael acceptor, an alpha beta and saturated carbonyl compounds. Uh, so here we know the first step is the formation of uh, the nucleophile and enolate. So here our static material, the ketone. Or react with the base, a base abstract uh, the acidic alpha hydrogen to get enolate ion. Look at the shift of electrons taking place, and here we are getting the enolate, the Michael donor. In the second step, the formed enolate, that is the Michael donor, react with the Michael acceptor. See so here, an alpha beta unsaturated compound, which is Michael acceptor. Here I take methylvinyl ketone so in this step the enolate adds to the michael acceptor the alkene pi electrons of the michael acceptor push towards the carbonyl carbon and the carbonyl pi electrons are displaced towards the oxygen to get a carbon carbon single bond uh, between Michael donor and Michael acceptor. Here we are getting an alkoxide ion which is less stable. So this is the bond formed between Michael acceptor and Michael donor to get the alkoxide ion which is less stable. In the next step, the alkoxide abstract proton from water. See here, the negative charge on the oxygen shift towards the carbon-carbon double bond which makes this carbon-carbon double bond more basic and the proton is abstracted from water to get our Michael addition product which is a 1,5-dicarbonyl compound. See here, this carbon-carbon double bond was there before which abstracted a proton. Now we are getting a 1,5-dicarbonyl Michael addition product. Next phase is aldol condensation reaction of the formed 1,5-dicarbonyl compound. So the first step is a deprotonation reaction. A base abstract the alpha hydrogen to get an enolate. The carbon is negatively charged here. See here the base, base is abstracting uh, the proton and we are getting our enolate. We can rewrite the formed enolate like this to understand the ring formation better. In the next step, the formed enolate, the carbon with negative charge, attack the positively charged carbon of the carbonyl group. See here, the carbon with negative charge attack the partially positive charged carbon of the carbonyl group to get a six-membered alkoxide ion. A six-membered alkoxide ion formed undergo protonation here. See here, the alkoxide formed get protonated and we are getting an alcohol along with an OH- ion. Next step is a dehydration of formed alcohol. The alcohol is dehydrated when heated. An alpha hydrogen is removed by the OH- which is formed in the last step and from the beta position, see this is the beta position and OH- groups leave group leave the ring and you are getting an aldol condensation product and the, here is the H minus and this completes the Robinson annihilation reaction getting an alpha beta unsaturated cyclic ketone. So uh, to summarize we can summarize uh, the reaction that reaction begins with Michael addition followed by an intramolecular aldol condensation to give a new six-member ring containing an alpha, beta, unsaturated ketone. Thank you. I hope you understand this reaction.